Hey guys, this is Jaden here, and today in this video, I wanted to take the time to talk to you guys about a certain King of the Hill episode that FXX is about to air, known as Cheer Factor. Now, um, okay, so yeah, Cheer Factor, that one cheerleading episode where Peggy is teaching Connie's cheerleading team, and I wanted to make this video that talks to you guys about a certain problem that I have with the episode now okay now this might not be a big problem so don't expect me to um go into a like a huge raging rant of me losing my shit or anything like that no 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 um i'll try and make this more of a calm rant and don't think that um i think cheer factor is a bad episode no i think cheer factor is a good episode i don't think it's insanely high up there for the best king of the hill episodes but so i think cheer factor is a good episode it's got good writing and some funny moments in it like for example that one scene where um the girl is criticizing her costume saying that it smells like a butt <laughs> but um yeah um i don't think it's an amazing episode but i think it's a good episode that can be fun to watch but there is this certain little problem that I have with the episode, and it doesn't really make a whole lot of sense. Now, here's the little problem I have with the episode. Why are Khan and Min nowhere to be found in this episode? Now, I understand that Khan and Min are absent in most episodes of King of the Hill, and I think that's justified for the most part, especially since they're not friends with the Hills or anything. But with Cheer Factor, this right here... I mean, yes, it makes sense for them to not get a lot of screen time in the episode, but that doesn't mean, like, you know, they shouldn't be the episode. It, it doesn't make any sense for them to not be in this episode. Because, yeah, it's a, it's a Peggy-centric episode, and it's a Connie-centric episode, but this episode is about their freaking daughter, Connie. Connie being in a cheerleading team for football, which is, like, a big thing, which is, like, something I'm sure they would want to support. And the episode has, like, all these scenes of um, them showing the audience watching the football game, watching the cheerleading and all that. And, okay, why is it that in none of those scenes, Khan and Min are not found? Like, why aren't Khan and Min anywhere to be found in this episode? Like, could you not have at least, like, um, show up some kind of, like, background shot that uh, shows them watching Connie cheerlead or, I don't know, maybe, like, do some kind of, like, small scene, that even if it's not a background scene, but, like, some kind of small five-second scene that shows them um, cheerleading Connie because it doesn't make any sense for them to not support Connie, their daughter that they love so much, on cheerleading, especially, like, not, like, when back in that one Governor Richards episode of King of the Hill, that's another episode where um, Con and Min aren't important in all that much and they don't have any speaking lines. But still, like, during the climax of the episode with um, Bill's birthday, you could see they have all these background shots that show Con and Min being there for Bill's birthday. Why the fuck would they show up for a birthday of a neighbor they're not friends with all that much? Why would they show up for Bill's birthday, but not for Connie's cheerleading stuff? That makes no sense at all. Could they not have at least like showed some kind of, could they not have at least do some kind of like background shot with Connie in it? Because really it doesn't make a whole lot of sense for them to not be in this episode. And that's like the main problem I have with this episode, even though it might not be a big problem, but when you think about it, it really doesn't make a whole lot of sense. And I feel it's pretty out of character for both Khan and Min. Unlike probably every other King of the Hill episode where Khan and Min are absent, I don't think it makes any sense for them to be absent here. But yeah, that's like a kind of like a small problem with the episode. I don't think it takes away from the episode too much. This is still a good cheerleading episode. I think even if Khan and Min were in it, maybe they would make it better, but not like way better, but like more like very slightly, like very marginally better. And yeah, overall, I think this is just like a good episode. I don't think it's a great episode, but I think Cheer Factor is still a good, solid King of the Hill episode. Um, that should be a nice watch, especially if you're a King of the Hill fan like I am. And on a scale of 1 to 10, I think I would give it a 7 out of 10. But that's just my opinion, guys. If you guys want to, you can let me know in the comment section down below. Like, if you agree with my opinion on this episode, what do you think of Cheer Factor from King of the Hill? Do you think it's a bad episode? Do you think it's an okay episode? Do you think it's a great episode? Um, You can let me know in the comment section down below if you want. And that's about it for the video, everybody. Have a good rest of your day. Bye, and thanks for watching.